Hi, I'm William Spaniel. Let's learn some game theory. Today we're going to use forward induction to solve a modified form of the stack hunt. We've seen this game before quite a few times, so you should be able to recall that there are two equilibria to a stag hunt, one where both hunters chase down a stag, and one where they both hunt down rabbits. And we can draw out the extensive form like this. Remember that the dashed line player 2 has for her information set indicates that she's unsure where she is in the game, that is, she doesn't know how player 1 moved when it's her turn to move. Also, keep in mind that we can't be sure which equilibrium the players will converge on. Hunting a stag gets them the biggest payoffs, but chasing rabbits is actually a safer choice for both of them. Now we're going to add a new option for player 1, which is to invite player 2 to the pub. This is actually a pretty good result for both of them, as they will both be able to enjoy 2.5 points, or should I say pints, of utility. If player 1 takes this option, then player 2 will never get a chance to move. But suppose that player 2 does, in fact, get a chance to move. How is she going to interpret that? Well, she should notice that player 1 has refused 2.5 points of guaranteed utility. The only reason he would want to do this is if he expected he would get more by continuing the game. And she should notice that in three of the four payoffs, player 1 gets less than 2.5. As such, for player 1 to rationally decline to invite player 2 to the pub, he has to be expecting the stag-stag equilibrium. And if player 1 is going to choose stag, then player 2 is best served hunting a stag as well. Consequently, stag-stag is our unique perfect Nash equilibrium, because 3 is greater for player 1 than having invited player 2 to the pub and only getting 2.5 points of utility. Thus, player 1 doesn't have any incentive to change his moves, and player 2 doesn't have any incentive to change her moves either. Thus, despite the fact that player 1 never uses the pub option, the mere presence of it allows the players to coordinate on the best possible outcome.